Hey guys, it's Tantalus Dan here, and uh, I've been suffering from a couple of issues with my PC. Uh, basically, when I've installed my GPUs on a Windows 10 device, this is a complete fresh build, um, I've been getting no signal through the GPUs. Now, uh, basically, uh, I think I've come up with a solution, and I thought I'd show people on YouTube because of course other people are going to have issues like this um, I've been doing a lot of research and I think I've figured it out so basically um, I've took the GPUs out of the PC so it's running on the motherboard output the HDMI output and basically I'm going to go into uh, device manager oh my keyboard's on the floor give me a sec sound device manager so I'll zoom this in I don't have a OBS or anything so I can't record on screen uh, display adapters and you go to your Intel uh, the basically on board at uh, the motherboard uh, output and disable it Now, now you've done that, uh, shut down your PC, install your GPU into the motherboard. I've got two 1080s SLI. Oh, God, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, I've got two 1080s SLI, uh, but I'm only going to put one in for now, just so then I can install all the drivers. Uh, I don't know if this is, like, if it's better to have them both in or not, but uh, I'm just going to put one in. Uh, but hopefully... If you put the DVI cable in to your GPU, it should load up. So I'll be back with you in a second after I've installed them. Okay, so I've I've just put my uh, graphics card in uh, and put all the power to it and connected the DVI cable on it. Uh, by the way, just a quick note, I'm hoping everyone already knows this, but if you're going to install a GPU, make sure you've got all the powered like disconnected to it or plugged out before you do it just wanted to put that in first so hopefully now that I've disabled the uh, internal motherboard graphics card I'm hoping it should come on would help if I press the power button Hey guys, just a quick update, it's on now. Um, basically, I just used the HDMI cable in the graphics card instead of the DVI cable, and uh, it came on. So yeah, go into your device manager, disable your, um, your motherboard internal graphics card, uh, reconnect your GPU to your motherboard, and I just recommend connecting a DVI cable or and a HDMI cable at the same time uh, because it might be different for your GPU for some reason it's picked up my uh, HDMI instead of my DVI of course once I install all drivers and stuff it should be fine then but yeah I hope it sorts itself out for you and I hope you enjoyed this video boy boy